There's another ancient Jewish tradition in connection with Shabbat that goes back all the way to our matriarchs. This is a special mitzvah that all Jewish women and girls should light the Shabbat candles before Shabbat begins. To welcome the Shabbat in addition to the Kiddush that we mentioned yesterday and add holiness and peace in the home. This is obviously to be done before Shabbat begins. But as we mentioned, lighting a, a fire on Shabbat is prohibited. And this is actually not one of the um, 613 biblical mitzvahs. Although it was practiced back then, it was only added as a mitzvah by the rabbis at a later point. We find that when Abraham sends Eliezer to go find a wife for his son Isaac, and Eliezer comes back with Rebekah, and when Isaac brings her into the home where his mother Sarah used to live in the tent, it says that she was like Sarah, his mother. The commentaries explain that her candles that she lit for Shabbat radiated and shined. Although Abraham had been lighting the candles in between, this didn't reach the same level of holiness, of light, that a young Jewish girl could bring about with her Shabbat candles. If there's no women and girls in the home, then the male lights the candles instead. Today's mitzvah is once again the mitzvah of yet, that we mentioned yesterday to remember the, Shab- the Shabbos and um, through pronouncing its, its holiness and uniqueness when it enters over a cup of wine on Kiddush and when it goes out by Havdalah by separating between Shabbat and the week. Thank you all for joining.